Hello, my name is Jade and this is my channel. Today this video is going to be consisting of three jars and some rice. It's the first time I've ever done this experience. I know someone who is currently doing this experience. I haven't spoken to her about it, but I'm willing to give it a go. So this jar has the word love on. Ignore and hate. Apologise for the wrong way around. But first of all, what we're going to do is we're going to put the rice into these three jars. Let me see if I can find it. Okay. I'm not 100% sure the amount of rice. So if we just go with half the jar, as you can see. And then after that, we fill it up with water. I haven't ever done this before, as I've said. So I thought I'd try it. But I'll show you all with me. Because I've got a channel. Been wondering what video to do next, so I thought this one would be the best video to do. Okay, so three jars, all filled with rice. That didn't look like they were all the same length. So perfect. Okay, now we're going to fill them up to wa with water till about here, just the rim. I can't find my my lids, so I just used tin foil. <laughs> Getting in view there. Okay, so we're going to fill up the hate jar. If you've ever done this or is currently halfway through this, leave a comment just below. I'd love to hear everybody's experiences and how you feel. Did it work? Did it not work? So all three jars are now full. So what we do now is just place the lid back on top. I don't know if this is going to work because I don't know if there needs to be a locked seal or not. Okay, now for the last one. So I heard that this experiment is meant to explain and show to you how damaging words can be. So for 30 days, starting from today, which is the 3rd of January, 2018. So Happy New Year to everybody. This is my first video of the year. Um, anyway, I shall be throwing, well, attempting put hate words into this jar. We'll, we'll see how that goes. I've got to ignore this jar so nothing shall be said. Just just leave this, just ignore this. Is exactly what it says on the jar. And love. I have a lot of love to give, so I'm hoping this one's gonna ferment quite a bit. But we shall see. So I'm quite drawn to this one. But um as you can see, they're all 
little there. I shall now leave them in my kitchen and I shall make a short video or take some photos every every day or every other day and keep you all updated. So I hope to hear, see yours. I look forward to, to seeing your videos. Bye.